Just in this noon, Bulldog and Buckeye players and fans are in the A, and the College Football Hall of Fame is giving them a warm welcome. 11 Alive's Reggie Chapman is there. It was a really busy morning here at the College Football Hall of Fame for Peach Bowl Media Day. Both Georgia and Ohio State sat and talked with the media for 45 minutes, giving us unparalleled access, giving us a chance to really ask whatever we wanted heading to the big game. At this point, it's best teams in the country playing the best teams in the country. You know, however, you know, each team gets here, that's their own story, but you know, there's four teams left. You know, everyone's got a chance to win it. When you get the opportunity to go against another great team and other great players, um, it definitely, it definitely brings an extra sense of motivation. You know, um, just wanted to just go out there and compete at the highest level. You know, uh, that's what you come to UGA for. And um, like I said, that's what they went to Ohio State for, for, for games like this. Um, I think everyone is really taking practice seriously. And we're just, that's a good thing because there have been some different things that switch from Athens to Atlanta, um, the bowl events. But ultimately, we do have a game to play. And I think the guys have handled it really well. So I'm really proud of the way that, you know, some of the younger guys and even some of the older guys are handling things. And I really appreciate the attention to detail. As you guys can imagine, we've got plenty of sound from both these teams. Maria Martin and myself will have stories for you all day long right here on 11 Alive. Cover the College Football Playoff inside the College Football Hall of Fame. I'm Reggie Chapman, 11 Live Sports. New today, we are digging deeper into what the Peach Bowl means for the city of Atlanta. The game alone is expected to bring in $60 million. Atlanta businesses are also getting ready for a boost. We talked to the president and CEO of the Atlanta Convention and Visitors Bureau, who says because the game is on New Year's Eve, the economy will get some extra points.